Hey guys, and welcome to another Redstone TNT Cannon video, and in this video I'll be going over the handheld TNT Cannon. But first, let's have some backstory to how this began. Of course, one of the biggest flaws of normal TNT cannons is that once you fire them, all your opponent has to do is move out of the way before they get hit. Or, or not. But here's the main problem of the cannon. Once you fire it once, it's, it's always going to hit the same spot, for the most part. And of course, you'll never actually get the person, because no matter how hard you try, it's either just a matter of chance or etc. You're just not going to hit them unless you're really, really lucky. And of course, that's when I had a revelation. Well, why not just hold the TNT cannon? Like, if I can aim it wherever I want, then what? Like, why have it secured on the ground? This cannon does basically the same thing as this one does. As you can see, it's it's obviously modeled after it. Um, so and it just fires TNT. So it is amazing because you can just shoot it wherever you want, whenever you want, and you can guarantee that you're gonna hit your target. And I figured I'd add in some clips of me just destroying some bosses with it. Because why not? And one more cool thing I figured out, um, you can dual wield it. And you can fire both at once, and fire both at once downward, then you can just rock it into the stratosphere. Because why not? <laughs> I mean, that's cool. It doesn't work if you only have one. You can just like slowly hover, but if you have two, then it works. Alright guys, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next episode. See ya.